Hey guys, and I'm back with another video. So today's video, I'm just going to do, you already know, it's unwrapping time. So I'm about to just um, unwrap some things and I'm going to just talk to y'all, you know, as I go. So yeah, let's go and get into it. So yeah, um, how y'all like the um the Cardi B Future and Megan Thee Stallion um new song WAP? Yeah, I like it. It's alright. I really like um the visuals, like the video when they was both like holding the snake. I really love that part. And I also like um I didn't ask for this thing. I asked for a white one. I don't even know if I want to um, buy this. Did I ask for a white or a black? I asked for a black one, right? Oh, no. I don't even know what I should do. Just open it up. You go over it. I'm just... I asked for the same shirt, guys, but... I export in black. But it's just basically like a blouse. You know what I'm saying? Like a mesh blouse. That's what it is. Puppy mesh. You know, and that's how it looks, guys. You know, but I thought I exported in black. I thought I ordered it in black. You know what I'm saying? But they gave me white. You know, I'm still going to wear it. Or I'm not. I might just send it back and get the color that I actually asked for. But like I was saying, guys, um, you know, how y'all like the video? You know. Um, I also like the dance routine when Megan and Cardi was dancing. I really like that, you know, a lot. But I just feel like they did not need to add the culture vulture, Kylie Jenner, you know, to walk down the hallway and open the door. You know, like... You know what I'm saying? It just it was she was just never needed in that video. She brought nothing to the video. She didn't dance. She don't rap. She don't sing. You know. What do she do? You know. I thought her sister was the model, Kendall. I didn't know she was the model, you know. So if anything, you know, I just feel like they should have had like, you know, another famous black person or an up and coming black person in the video. I see that they only had Miss Mulatto in the video for a second. It's like I had to blink just to see her. Like, is that Mulatto? Is that Sukiyana? I just felt like they should have had Sukiyana dancing, you know, or even Miss Mulatto dancing a little more. They did give a little shine to Normani. She was dancing. She like, There's some holes in this house. There's some, I really like Normani part as well. I mean, of course, you know, there's a lot of people hating on the video, but I love the video. It's just like a lot of vulgar, explicit words or whatever, but, you know, I mean, I would listen to it. I, you know, I'm not going to let my kids be listening to that like that. I won't let them listen to the song, but I would listen to it. I'm an adult, so, you know, it's okay to get a little raunchy. I used to listen to Lil' Kim back in the day, even when I was young, when I was too young to be even listening to her and the things she was talking about, you know what I'm saying? Like, the sexual things she would be talking about, like, on hardcore CD. So, you know what I'm saying? I mean, if that's what y'all got to do to sell records, you know, and talk, you know, that freak, nasty, explicit stuff, then, you know, more power to y'all. I mean, I like it. I don't have anything bad to say about, you know, the song. I like the song. It was catchy. You know, like I said, I love the video. I love the visuals in the video. Like, y'all holding the snakes and then y'all, like, laying beside each other, like, touching all on each other with the snakes and shit. I really like that. And I also like the dance routine. And also when um, Cardi was dancing, when she was, like, in the water, all wet. She had that wet hair look. And I love the, um, you know, the fountain with the little, the titties fountain, the breast fountains with the, the water spraying out of the, the areola. I was, I was like, oh, this is a little freaky little video. But it was nice, though, with, like, butts, butt molds and um, pictures all in the video. 
breasts with the areolas as water fountains. I just thought it was cute. You know. Of course, guys, I'm gonna open this up. So this what this is, guys. Another Roku remote. I needed this. I was about to lose my mind. My other Roku remote got messed up on my TCL TV, so this came in handy. You know, it only took like two business days to get here, so, you know, I'm thankful for this. So, whatever, my little remote. So, now I can be back in business watching all my little YouTube videos, watching my own YouTube videos. And, um, I just want to show y'all one more thing. I got, I'm trying something new, guys. Let me know in the comments. Have y'all ever tried this before? The Snickers low fat milk. It's like a chocolate milk. And you know, just let me know what y'all think of it. I'm about to try it right now, right on camera. So I'm gonna show y'all what I think of it. You know what I'm saying? So, it's the Snickers chocolate low fat milk. Natural and artificial flavors. 14 G protein per bottle. Made with real milk. So let's see. Let me know what y'all think about the Snickers low fat milk in the comments. And I hope y'all like my unwrapping haul. And I'll see y'all on the next one. Please like, share, and subscribe to my video. Give this video a thumbs up. And I'll see y'all on the next one. Bye guys. Hey guys, and I'm back with another video. So today's video is just the part two of me just showing you all, you know, um, the after, um, after I tried the shirt on to just show y'all how it looks. So it's like a um, mesh blouse, you know, um, with the, it's like a um, halter top basically with the um, shoulders cut off and it's like mesh, fluffy mesh. So I just wanted to, you know, show y'all this is how it looks you know i just thought it was cute it was unique i really wanted it in black but i guess they must um they didn't have it in stock but instead of just them just letting let me know on the email or just telling me they was out of the black ones they just sent me the white ones so i'm like i don't know if i should keep it y'all let me know in the comments i think it's cute it's really cute you know i just thought it was unique i like unique stuff i don't just like everything that other people like you know i don't just follow the trend i like you know unique like weird like clothes and stuff i just thought it was so cute the meshy little you know fluffy blouse you know but tell me what y'all think about it let me know in the comments you know should i keep the shirt should i take it back and you know should i order the black one should i call them and curse them out, email them and curse them out and say, no, y'all better send me my black blouse right now. Let me know what y'all think about it, you know, because I really wanted it in black. I don't know. It's just like when I seen that, the black one, the black shirt, it just, it just pop. But this one pop as well. I like it as well, but you know, so I'm just showing y'all how it looks or however, but I prefer, you know, the black mesh blouse. But let me know what y'all think about it, you know. Let me know, should I keep it? Should I order the black one? Should I call them and bomb them out for sending me the wrong shirt? Even as the right shirt, but it's the wrong color. You know, let me know what y'all think about it. I still think it's cute. I still like it, regardless. But um, just let me know. And um, I'll see y'all on the next one. Bye, guys.